Hello and welcome to the next episode. I do some days of break because well I didn't feel well. Now back into it. This episode we are going to see one major thing. First of all there is a ship here which is arriving in about two weeks. Uh one month, sorry. More than two weeks. So. Um and so two mission phases that's what I was thinking about. And also, we are in a situation to think about what we want to do now in regards to either our control points or in regards to space. We do have limited amount of MC currently available because we can maybe go to 36 or something, but then we are really stressing our hate limit currently, which is 50 before the aliens get really nasty about it and we already I'm took here. out some agents on earth we need a next one for our containment project which we are pushing here which is going to finish in about yeah one and a half month if no event comes in between and that's going to be of course our next objective so we are going to go to ground here stabilizing everything a little bit and then continue searching for an alien again before we contain him basically and everything else is all about China right now we already controlled two points here we can afford one more with the transnational coordination here it's going to give us 40 we do have seven left here this one takes yeah 39 so it's not really any spare we do have another project available here for I think it was common cause for 10 for 2k that's relatively cheap we could also get another 5 for 2k um, management research here so that's like 15 yeah but so 15 plus 7 22 that's like half a point we can also add another administration node here which is going to give us how much exactly or yeah also not that much on our shipyard as soon as it has upgraded but basically we are looking at a problem that we can take one more one definitely two with a little bit of excess here but we are definitely far away from the additional 80 that we require to take over China fully and that's of course the biggest problem I want to investigate right now because then we can get going on welfare, fixing the economy here, build some mission control. And basically we don't want to improve the economy here at all or a lot. It's just maybe a little bit so that we just keep the 32, 35 investment points that we have here and invest all of that into mission control and welfare and a little bit of knowledge and economy here. So that's our goal that we want to achieve. And of course, later on, we want to make the Pan-Asian Pan combine and then fold all that stuff which is here into China as well. Yeah, and so let me just skip ahead to the two mission phases until we are in our battle, unless something happens before that. And we can just prepare everything for the next alien hunt. Okay, here we are, and let's go. The alien Victor 6 is arriving here, and ah, interesting. They ended the war, okay. Nerva Drive. I don't recall what it exactly does, I need to check it out. Okay, and we are going to sort the, of course, our Foxtrot fleet here. 1.6 hours, 0.1 KPS, it's fine. So transfer there and come on, come on, come on. Game, what's happening? Oh, I must, <laughs> I must unpause my mistake. Um, yeah, engage, start battle, perfect. We are going to with the highest initial velocity here, just that our rockets also have a little bit of that boost here. Nothing else is important. We're going to pick them as a target here. We are going to retrack radiators, even though I don't think that plays any role. 
and then let's go. Distance is 1,200 kilometers, so at 1,000 they, oh, even earlier they shoot. Perfect. And our red dots here are flying. Some will be shot down, but that's not enough. And there we are. Easy peasy. What kind of alien ship? What alien ship? There's nothing on orbit here. Perfect. First fight. Couldn't be easier. And yeah, in case you have uh, struggled with your aliens early on, that's how you do it. Perfect. So which alien spacecraft? Although we have been able to, to some extent, study alien technology before, now that we have access to one of those craft in its entirety, we got them to find. This is how they access our skies. This is how they travel within the solar system. This is what we must learn from and perhaps even emulate if we are to, tr to truly do the same or so. Even a preliminary appraisal of the retrieved vessel has, some, has revealed a sizable quantity of material that defy easy categorization. Something that is not only countless steps beyond our own technology, but profoundly different from it. Something perhaps that would not exist in our solar system had these beings not brought it here. If you can understand it, the potential is beyond words. Okay. Salvaged alien technology. We have retrieved a veritable treasure trove of extraterrestrial technology. A raft of inscrutable machines whose even basic function currently eludes us. Metals whose very structure is widely unfamiliar, and even screws and bolts with almost preposterous tensile strength. To call this a mother load would be an understatement of the millennium. We have so much to learn from every last fragment of this hall, for it surely represents the technology apex of a species that has somehow found a way to travel from a far distant world to ours. We've defeated the aliens of the field. Objective complete. Now to gather the spoils. Well, we did it. We took an a we took on the aliens on the field of battle and won. And we have earned the spoil. Working examples of alien technology. If things weren't so dire, I would be celebrating. We would be celebrating. Actually, science teams are celebrating anyway. Never seen these guys so excited. I feel like slapping them down and reminding them just how many lives those shiny toys cost us. But I suppose there's no point. The stuff we got in the labs now is beyond anything that has ever been produced on Earth. Any R&D company would kill for just a sniff. If we were in the business of making money, we would be set for life. But we are not... We are fighting for humanity and for Earth, and this stuff only matters if it can help with that. There's a long road ahead, but we are one step further along it. Yes, perfect. Um, research alien technology when we can. Recovered alien, avian alien corpse. We have successfully retrieved the body of one of the creatures we have nicknamed Griffins. A preliminary assessment confirmed that it's an entirely different species to the aliens first encountered on Earth. As different from them as humans are from the dragonfly. Indeed, so thin and hollow are these alien bones, it seems unlikely that they even originate from the same planet as the other aliens. Most probably, it hails from a far lower gravity environment, which would also explain how rarely this particular species has been sighted on Earth. But the bone structure actually invites comparison to avian life on Overworld, hence the designation Griffin. The similarities end there. This creature is, in every sense of the world, word alien. We got 500 influence as reward as well. Nice. We got promotions. A Lieutenant Sunshak Kovulov, Engineer Officer. Interesting. And um, we got a little bit of exotics here. Perfect. And now we had four or five stars. Yeah, that was to be expected here. Now let's get back to Earth, in fact. Then not much has changed. I just did basically the same missions as the mission before. Going to launch back to the shipyard here again. 1.4 KPS will it cost us though? It's fine. Perfect. And we're going to replay fuel and resupply here. Because we know already that there is a second ship coming in the in December. Yeah, perfect. December is the next supposed transfer of an, of an agent, and of course that's not going to happen here. Mm, okay, what else we, do we want to do here now? Um, oh yeah, the promotion system, how does that even work? I don't know. 
Can I somehow view? Ah, here, Lieutenant Panzer Kravulov, Engineer Officer. Officer in charge of the ship's reactor and other critical system. Reduces internal damage taken by the ship by 5%. Increase the ship's repair speed at shipyards by minus 20%. Increase the post combat salvage by 10%. Ooh, nice. So we get more salvage from the next ship we kill. Great. Okay, and I think the next step is the alien containment here. Yes. So let's progress here until we got that science covered. A new project, Griffin Autops Autopsy. Yes, perfect. Yeah, most likely they will really hunt us now. I would say at least chances, chances for that are high. I'm going to protect... Ooh. Ooh. Someone is working on Kazakhstan here. Nation. I'm here. Let's protect it again. Safe for our and what we should do here, we should go away from spoils for a while. And go into Unity here. Yes. That should help us a little bit in getting the unrest under control because it's partially driven probably by the cohesion. And yeah. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, we, should, we need to fix this. But we, we can, most likely. On the other hand, uh, Kazakhstan is no longer important. Yeah, in fact, we could consider to drop it now. But it has. It has one mission control. You know what? We're just going to spoil it until it's gone. Because we can use these 20 points to rather have something in China, which is half a point. And I'm definitely in favor of that. Um, I got to China here. Oh, publicity has... No, it has risen, in fact. Hmm. I'm not 100% sure how to do it right now. The technology here we will get eventually, like in some months, probably. Let's finish this quest here. And... No, we don't need to do the unrest mission here, because we don't care. Let's continue on Mexico, because that's important. Let's keep going here. Securing our interests. Offering assistance. Okay, research alien technology. I don't think that's going to give us mission control, right? Uh, or command point. No, it doesn't. So, fine. Now the orbit core is done, which means we can add here the solar array, of course. We can also make an admin node here. Mm. Other stuff here will stay for a while, for a moment at least. Um, okay, we need to check out what we got here. We have Xeno Station, which is only Xeno Labs, and then we have Social Station, which is only Social Lab for the bonuses on Earth, which is obvious. And now we could consider what else we want. Space Science gives Mission Control bonus, not that important right now. Material gives military bonus, also not important. This one gives welfare bonuses, so life science is something I want. So let's do one, two, three, four here. And total power consumption. That's fine, we can continue. Let's do two more. Yes, let's do two. Yes, that's fine. So we are going to get 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 18 bonus to welfare now. That's important already. <clears throat> yeah, perfect. Let's keep it this way. I will and report when my mission is complete. continue here. Of course, also a little bit of science. Person of interest here. surveilled. Um, servants continue. Yeah, let's continue uh, once more, but we can now check her orcs, in fact. 
And ooh, that looks like admin to me. Two times admin. Ooh, three times admin. Ah, four times admin. Hmm. Wouldn't be a shame if someone would steal that. Is abating. We've so. moved the needle. Wouldn't that be a shame? Alien containment is finished. Our architect architects have devised an alien containment facility that is disarmingly simple but highly effective in its design. Essentially, two concentric circles are placed at the precise center of a large triangle. The inner detainment chamber utilizes a multi stage particular articulate absorbing filtration system to protect against ferrocyte release so that we may safely monitor the entity from the outer circle. Each corner of the triangle houses a heavily armed guard post, the equal distance between ensuring each that, that in the unlikely event that the captive escaped then slew or turned personal within one of one of them the other two can respond simultaneously. Okay. We're ready to perfect the demon colonel. We have set up city yeah. So. We also start anti-personal mind within the cell. I'm keeping hold of the detonator just in case. Yes. And now we want to bring in a life hydra. Perfect. So next one. Could either think about getting rid of some of our influence for money. So that we just invest a little bit into. Um, so. This would be regularitary capture, for example, here. Mm, could also do the cybernetic implants here to invest some of our cash into buffs to our agents. I do like that one. But we could also progress on our quests here. Hmm. A lot of options. Perfect. What is cheap, though? Mm, all these don't give any MC or CP. Let's do direct investment here because we can definitely go down to like 1k influence without having a problem here. Well, okay, we are going to skip ahead here because basically we're going to try to steal everything from Sebastiana if we can. But if we can play this... Oh, dry hole. Hmm. We survey the side. Yes, please. Ooh, minus 50%. Mass 6. Which one is that? Eh. It was a good one, but it's fine. That hurts. Rubbing up here. We definitely need also the technology which decreases the chance for dry hole. So that's something we need to do. In fact, we should get under get one of these technologies under control. At once atomic manipulation would be something because we need to go into quantum computing. So that's the right direction here. Well, so a lot of options of course. And we need to find a new agent here. Uh, First Nation. I'm not sure that I'm going to do this this playthrough because we don't necessarily get much from that. I mean, yes, we can get rid of the colony status of White Horse, but it's not that valuable anymore. Okay, so mm, let's skip ahead a bit. In this episode, a lot of things happen very quickly, apparently. So just after we already stole one orc, an alien has revealed itself here by doing some stuff. And we are going to investigate him, of course, immediately. And we are going to try to steal the remaining Edmund orc from Sebastiana here. And that would be awesome. She has... She's already out. They will now save us. But that won't matter, apparently. Perfect. Continue. Ah, really? 100? They will now serve but us. we can take this one here as well. What else is here? Nothing of note. Okay. Mm. We've got some intel on our target. <laughs> Your terrorism will not go unpunished. It's fine. Oh, we found the first one. Nice. Perfect. 
and we are going to of course improve our knowledge here and now she only has Marius Grants left because she doesn't have the admin to keep everything else mm, but probably she's going into hiding so we are not going to bother next phase with her Recon complete. we also investigated what he did there and of course aliens won't like it that we I'm not sure if they, the servants already can speak to them, so... Where to? Ooh, also new orcs we, we have here. Ooh, more with persuasion. That's perfect, because then we can... Um, yeah, let's get rid of this one. Not that important anymore, so let's take you. There are 23 now. Another one here with persuasion, which means we're going to temporarily unequip this one here. Yeah, yeah, I know. Mm. Yeah, we're going to wait until we can upgrade something here into something much better. We're going to investigate it in between there. And now we can finally push him up here. So he's now going to get a lot more admin now he's suddenly at 20. he doesn't really have a specific role yet but due to the fact that he is a quick learner he can become a lot of things mm. yeah these are the ones we just sold this one is still not worth it for this campaign Do we need the money maybe i don't know mm. but i'm going to stick to give him this one because it's a really nice one that's probably enough for the moment for him okay mm, yeah now we are going to of course try to your orders see what we can do here we're going to go with eight lots we can segment now four should be enough here investigating target mm, i'm here can you already target it 70%. 46. We could risk it. Oh no, wait. wait. <laughs> that was close. We do need to detain him, not kill him. That was close. Uh, so we need Ready. Sheena to do this effect. So we definitely. Yeah, yeah. Um... Yeah, okay, she definitely needs to do the investigate here, and we need to improve her investigation skill here. Ready to go. But basically, now we got a lot more free power Ready to take mission. over a point here. Which means I'm going to go for the fourth one here. Bringing them to our side. And... What's the up? Yeah, let's skip two mission phases ahead, because I'm going to investigate that alien. And I'm or one mission phase, and I'm going to try to get her investigation higher to 25. Maybe I can't do this. Oh, well, we got our third point here. We are slightly above our cap, which is fine there. And now we are, of course, going to do the same as usual here invest into the things we need right now. And perfect. And also, our agent has been able to be improved to 25 investigation. We moved some orcs around and also used some experience me? points. And now we do have 25 here. The chance is only 10% there, but 58 if we try it. We could do another investigate. Would be possible. Then we go up to plus five. So that's probably worth it. That's why I want to do this. Tracking target. I don't want to lose Ready him. For I orders. hope that we can make this work. Another alternative is of course that we try to take mission. over stuff here from him because he doesn't have any admin. But mm, we don't really have many orc spots to store currently. And I'm not sure when which mission is going to hit. So if we can do the hostile takeovers before the... Wait a second, is that even going against security or is it going against something else? 
Yeah, it's going against 18 security. I mean, you could try feeling awkward. Hmm. I don't know. We'll Let's bring try it up. At your service. I don't know how it exactly works. So if you can just try to do a hostile takeover here. Targeting their assets. And we you as well. Where do you need me? So try it. Targeting Maybe it works. Us. Maybe it doesn't. I don't know. So let's see. Moving here, fine. Offering not worse than before. Org acquired. Ha! <laughs> it really hit before. Okay, um, plus one, plus one, plus one, plus one. So let's just take this one. Asset acquired. And let's take this one. And we are already. Yeah, okay. We need to. Uh, we need to sell something. Yeah, we don't need these. So. Oh, someone got that. Who took it? Ah, oh, doesn't matter. Okay, mm, and we are up to. Target oh. secure. Yes! <laughs> it really worked! <laughs> it really worked! But they are all the alien hate bar here already. Brilliant! They are not liking this. Okay, it is impossible to describe the sensation of gazing upon a creature from another world with one own eye. No worlds could adequately explain how uncanny it feels to see such a thing move and draw breath and turn its own unquestionably alien eyes upon us. Even had we set a po even had we sent a poet, they would not be able to convey the mingled sense of awe and wrongness. The terrifying privilege of beholding something that does not resemble anything else in human experience. The shape of a hulking skull, the tendrils that dance unnatural within the mouth. The way the light plays across flesh textured and patterned like nothing else on earth. Even these beings sound challenging being sound to challenge our very definition of language. The idea that we could ever know their minds seems, for now, frankly, laughable. Let us hope that will soon change. Regardless of the fleeting encounters we or others might have had previously, and no matter what happens next, this is a watershed moment never to be forgotten. Mission accomplished, Colonel. We're face to face with the enemy. I had to supervise this personally. A lot of the. Oh, that was my alarm. I had to supervise this one personally, a lot of the boys did not like the idea of keeping this one thing in one piece. Two of them tried to bring machine guns, just in case. This was just as well, we had just an atomic briefing. The intro was good, but this thing still got within 5 meters before we finally brought it down. I was worried we had done too much damage, but the thing's already regenerating. First time, I think that these things are so hard to kill. The chief xenologist says that it should be conscious within 24 hours. Now we need to figure out how to interrogate it once it breaks up. Okay, now we need to research higher language, of course. And yeah, the mission was a success. Perfect. And let's see if the retribution of the alien is... What? Alien conspiracy theories? Tapes and narrative. Ignore it. Of course, we are going to shape it. <laughs> Alien base. Okay. Move the needle. And yeah, they're going to not like us here. By the way, do we get intel here on the other agents? No, we don't. But I think four or five are gone. I'm not sure. I need to rewatch my other episodes and think about it. How many we now took out? I think four are gone now. And we intercepted one ship, another one is coming, so there are only two or one agent left on Earth. Awesome. And of course we are going to take him out as well as soon as we find him. And I think we made a huge progress here in this episode, which took about four months time bit more and we are going to progress in the next episode when we get into transnational coordination also cybernetic implants 
Cybernetic implants should give us about two per agent, so that's uh, not a lot. Two, two points here, plus the 40 here, which it's, it's basically another. We can go to the fourth one definitely next episode. Everything else will be hard to do. But it's still better than nothing here. And we are of course fixing already the inequality. It's going down slowly, so our efforts are having an impact here. And also there are new orcs available, in fact more admin. Awesome. So the only one is this guy. And we do have a security here. Class fund. I need to cons I'm going to think about this in in peace when I have time. But it was a great episode. This was a lot of action, a lot of things we did to slow down the aliens now and also to get us more time. No new ship has started to fly here. So it's still the same class as we already took out, meaning that this one will also be easy. And it will only arrive in December, so even everything up will be later than this. So everything else will arrive in 27 earliest, which gives us a lot of time to think about how we want to build up and what kind of defense fleet we actually want to build around Earth now, because we're going to need one. I'm definitely thinking or looking into ray guns, but we could also consider to just dive down on the rockets for the moment and just have a lot of them to, if there are only two or three ships that might work, but I'm not sure right now. Ray guns are of course relatively fail proof, even though we do need six or seven ships to make that work, but we do have time now and to do the alien language project and so on to get to the MC increasing um, technologies which give us more leeway here to do stuff. We don't need more mining right now, we do have enough to build ships right now, but we do need to of course figure out how we exactly want to play it. Also with controlling China soon, we already get almost 300 times here. We do have a really, really nice output here for this early in the game. And life sciences has 60% bonuses, but I don't think I need anything in life sciences which I need to do urgently. But let's see. Until then, see you, leave a like and subscribe. See you next time.